calling. Oh, hello. Oh, my mom. My mom is calling. So we... <laughs> I'm gonna have to call you back, mom. Hi, oh, Jamie's mom. I, I love you. I'll call you back in a little bit. Okay. Bye-bye. <laughs> it's time for the beer review. Hello, hello, everyone. Uh, quick thank you to the Gouda setting this whole ray train up for November. We are growing mows for bros. I didn't. I just grew a beard because I didn't want to mow. But uh, I think all together of all the different teams we've raised, I don't know, mm, somewhere between three and five hundred bucks, which is pretty sweet. Is that bad? I'm twelve, so I can't <laughs> grow a mustache. Yeah, yeah. I tried. And for anyone new to uh, the stream, The Beers and Beats, we are doing our weekly beer review. On top of that, our new segment is Pub Feed, where we cook pub food for each other. While yeah. Jamie pours, I'm going to tell you what we're listening to. We are listening to The Sneaky Snares. He's one of the Twitch homies. You can find him at sneakysnares.bandcamp.com. Really good producer, really great guy. What we are drinking tonight, Ooh. Bootstrap Brewing Company's Amber Ale. No fancy name, just called Amber. Nice looking can. <laughs> just straight to the point. It is 5.6% ABV. You can check them out at bootstrapbrewing.com. On the, from the get-go, like I'm not an Amber fan, but this can smells good already. And it is a common theme among all the beers that we review that they don't have websites. Bootstrap has a website. That's excellent. Add them to the chart of people who have websites. They describe Amber Ale as this delicious, crisp, and hoppy ESB-style Amber Ale is our favorite go-to beer when tubing down our favorite rivers and friends with friends and family, gluten-reduced. Not a fan of gluten-free beers, but we'll see how it works. Yeah, so if you're not into the old gluten thing, mm-hmm. you got it. Oh, yeah. Yeah, it's right. You can see it on the screen. design is excellent. Yeah, there is a goat on the can. Oh, because of the lights, you can't see it. Yeah. You'll find this on Instagram, Instagram.com slash beers and beats PDX, and on Untapped, Untapped. Robust. Very flavorful. Yeah. That's the best beer we've done so far. And it's my, one of my least favorite styles that we've done so far. I think yeah, it's it's, good. it's a lot of flavor, but it's not offensive. Yeah, it's not offensive in usually the Like, amber. when you get into the IPAs, they're very offensively IPA. This isn't bitter. It's really it's smooth on the end. Mm-hmm. There's a lot of flavor at first, but it, like, completely rounds off and leaves you with no real aftertaste. Just a good amber ale. So I think the reduced gluten helps with that. Like my normal amber go-tos are Fat Tire. I hate Fat Tire. It's the first beer I had in Portland, so it's more of a memory thing. The day I met the missus, dogs are freaking out. Nostalgia. And then um, Widmere has an amber. I always forget the name of it. But we spent uh, drop top. Boom. We spent years going balls deep on drop top. <laughs> and I think this beats it. It's way better. I agree, for sure. Yeah, yeah, I think this is better as well. It's very drinkable. Like it's almost light and easy going. I think we have some guests showing Yeah, up. <laughs> we have, Ashanti's here. Yeah. Oh. For real, Ashanti's here. Get over here. Yeah, we have some impromptu guests. Well, get in here. Get in here. Yeah, you want to talk shit? Let's go. What's going on with this nonsense beer over here? We have Black Tacular last minute. Uh, I'm a handsome black man, and you're not. <laughs> I mean, you can't prove they're not. Oh, thank you so much. And we got Lisa who brought Breakside Salted Caramel Stout. That's pretty um, 
unimaginative. There's like not, it's like very, mm, there's like not much it's going consistent. on there. It's consistent. That's yeah. what we think. It's consistent. Yeah, there, I mean, I could drink it for a while. There's just not much going on there. It's not like spicy or fruity or. It's not supposed to. It's just, it's just, just an amber. It's just an amber. Yeah, it work. Of all ambers, we're used to fat tire, drop top. Yeah, yeah. It's better than those. I'd say that too. Yeah. Not yeah. Not of, it's, yeah, fat tire's a bit malty, so not last a little yeah. longer, and you're like, mmm. I don't hate it. I don't hate it either. Good job, dude. <laughs> Second half. Trip. Okay, beer review. I give it a thumbs up. I'm like, I, I give it a thumbs up. It's fine. I'll give it a seven out of ten. Yeah, yeah, yeah seven out of ten. I go, go six. Six. I give thumbs up. He gives it six. Seven. Seven. I give it a point up for something I don't like. Dude, do you want to do the BLT review ball. also? Um, so mine is just lettuce and bacon, and it is Carolina Reaper mayo. Oh, oh, you fucking <laughs> serious today. <Okay. laughs> you want to try? Jamie's and Jaded, they have mango Trinidad scorpion mayo. Jeez, all ridiculous. Oh, Getting a little kick. It's not. Mm-hmm. It's coming. I feel something on the tongue there. <laughs> Make it perfect. Everyone, come on over. Plenty of room. So, John, if you didn't hear, every week we make yep. pub, we make the, pub food favorites. The scorpion sauce like is really nice. It's it's warm, but it doesn't overpower the flavor. This just a little, little bit of bite in the back of my tongue. Do you say the bacon's perfect? Bacon is perfect. Ooh, we were we had a big debate on how we should cook the bacon. Floppy, crunchy, or somewhere in between. And then and then your son came in and said, Are you cooking the bacon, Jamie? And I said, Yeah, he said, Good. <laughs> this isn't Canada. We prefer our bacon crispy. I like some crisp to it for sure. I want to do This is a great BLT. Mm-hmm. Not <clears throat> this is better. Crispy, but like still have a little give. Mm-hmm. So whenever I go to a diner, my go to Sandwich is a BLT. Really? This is better. Oh. Went to club. He wanted your bacon. Is that how you like to test a restaurant? Yep. French dip guy. I do a, my test is if you do a good chicken fried steak. Yep, that's my test. That's my test. And then I'll go, okay, whatever. Well, yeah. But I like, I also like club. Like, okay. I'm going to eat something I know you're not going to fuck. <laughs> so in grand total, beer, thumbs up. The meal's on point. Six or four. Seven, seven, BLT. I say it's the best BLT I've ever had. The mail is really on point. Really on point. It's barely a kick to it. Jamie, what do you say about your BLT? I'd eat two. I'd eat probably three or four. Wow. Mr. Jaded. Yeah, BL- BLT score, yeah. excellent. excellent. So there we have it. Beer review, it was Bootstrap Amber. Thumbs up. One of the better ones we've had so far. If you haven't seen any of the previous beer reviews, you can check out youtube.com slash beers and beats PDX. Also, untapped, no E, slash users, slash beers and beats PDX. Let's get back to the show. Oh, you already got that? Yeah, you're, you're, you're gonna hold one. Yeah. <laughs> Trickster? No, it's a good one, right?